The follow on from the straddle stretch is the side straddle, and that's going to stretch the latissimus dorsi and the quadratus lumborum. And so, what we're doing here is lift arm up, so lift the spine up. The other hand is going to come through to support or to support. Lift up, and you're going to rotate in this hand. It's going to come over and grab, grab the foot, and then you're pulling yourself sideways and then looking up to the sky and aiming to come down through here. The stretch for me is in the QL. My bum on this side, the left side, is just up just a little bit. If I had an assistant, I'd just get them to push my hip down very gently and I feel more of a stretch through here. Now again, you're looking from one side to the other. What's the shape of the spine? Are the knees bending or are they straight in here? Are the legs straight in here? And can, after, can I get my shoulder inside the light leg? And then really turn myself up. And then all the time trying to relax down. Onto the thigh. Okay, and then come out, you rotate out. Rotate out through here. Other side, which is gonna be a little bit tighter I think. Grab hold of the foot so you can brace. You can get a, a, a towel or a yoga strap and pull. Just get that rotation in through here. Okay. I can feel this buttock a little bit higher off, pretty hard to see from the camera. Uh, and the stretch is greater here, which is the quadratus lumborum, not so much in the lats on that side. Now I'm trying to rotate. I mean, just where you feel tight is just letting go. Where's the breath? Let go. Through there, and then rotate to come out of it. So you should see that expression or that sort of noise, and you know the client's stretching to optimal capacity, right? Rather than, you know, I don't want to do this. Right? There's not that attitude. If you have a monster face, your body freezes up. It's got to be zen.